Not a day goes by that someone in my life, either a friend, a client, a vibrant blue oil customer, or one of my kids' friends asks me about healing headaches with essential oils. So I don't know about you, but I really think headaches are kind of the worst. They're <laughs> enough to make you want to crawl into bed and pull up the covers and just cry. And while traveling this past weekend, I got such a doozy of a headache. Um, I'd hardly call it a fun experience, but it gave me personal insight into how to heal headaches with essential oils and how well oils actually work for pain relief. So as you may know, oils have many attributes that make them particularly well suited to offer headache relief, um, in part because of their anti-inflammatory properties and their ability to cross the blood-brain barrier. So headaches can result from a bunch of different triggers, but a key cause is inflammation. And what happens is that the blood flow uh, it, it gets dial constricted within the brain. And so this repeated dilation and constriction causes the nerve walls, which are pretty sensitive to pain, to stretch, resulting in the discomfort of a headache. So I personally like to test everything on myself before recommending it to others. I laid out all of the oils that I believe are helpful for headaches and I picked one. So let me tell you what I looked at and what I picked. The Migraine Relief blends basil, marjoram, lavender, peppermint, Roman chamomile, and helichrysum, which are all known to provide relief from inflammation and pain. And um, to use it, you would just rub a little bit on your temples and it can really help with the throbbing pain. Um, you can also put it on the forehead with a cold compress. Gallbladder. So in Eastern medicine, the gallbladder meridian traverses the part of the head where you would feel a headache. So if you follow that logic, anything that causes the gallbladder to be congested or not function well can cause a disruption in that meridian pathway and lead to a headache. So if you're going to reverse engineer the solution, supporting the gallbladder often helps to ease the stress on the gallbladder meridian and with it, the experience of a headache. Um, the gallbladder blend also contains chamomile, which is known to cross the blood-brain barrier and help to reduce inflammation and kind of calm headaches. So pretty much everyone I know, the gallbladder blend seems to really help with headaches. Another great choice is our anti-inflammatory oil, which includes several oils with powerful anti-inflammatory properties like frankincense, dill, and ginger. And if you reduce inflammation, it can kind of reduce the headache pain. Nerve repair is my favorite for any kind of pain or inflammation. It works really well on the body and the brain. It contains helichrysum, which is a super powerful anti-inflammatory oil and really expensive. So that's why we put it in this blend. Parasympathetic is kind of awesome and it's clove and lime. And if you just put it right on your temples, it helps to relieve headache pain. You can also put it behind the earlobe and it helps with any kind of pain. So lymph congestion can cause kind of that backup of pressure. Um, the brain is like a hydraulic system. If it doesn't flow, the pressure builds up. So opening up the lymph channels on the side of the neck can help to relieve, allow the fluid to drain and relieve pressure. Um, the adrenal blend, people don't know this, but blood sugar dysregulation uh, and the resulting high cortisol levels can result in chronic inflammation, which contributes to headaches. So if you balance the adrenals and help to kind of reduce cortisol levels, it can reduce headache pain. Lavender is the all around player, which is great for anti-inflammatory and sedative properties. And it's a really good oil to use if you're trying to alleviate the headache like at night when you need to relax. Peppermint is also one that people often mention because it contains significant amounts of menthol, which is known for helping to relax and ease the tension of headaches and muscular aches and pains. Although peppermint's really stimulating and so it can interfere with sleep. So I smelled all of the potential oils and then <laughs> applied a few drops of the migraine relief um, because that was what smelled best to me and I put it on my forehead and literally within a few minutes, the headache was totally gone. Uh, it was a really powerful uh, experience to learn how well oils work. So if you or anyone you love runs into headaches, I completely encourage you to look at essential oils as a cure. Hi, I'm Jody Cohen. 
founder of Vibrant Blue Oils. Thank you so much for watching this YouTube video. Please don't forget to subscribe by clicking the circle at the bottom of this screen. And if you want to access more free essential oil trainings, just visit vibrantblueoils.com backslash YouTube. You can find this link in the video description. Thank you again.